The ocean is massive, it's really big. We've only seen 5% of it, which means there are some amazing, incredible things that we've not even discovered yet. However, what we've observed is still quite bizarre, and some of the things we've seen are odder. If you think about the harsh circumstances, amazing geological features, and the eerie creatures that reside miles beneath the ocean, and your head could start to hurt a bit. In this video, we will explore some of the creepiest and bizarre things that we have found so far under the darkness of blue ocean. At number one of our list is the Baltic Sea Anome Alive. In 2011, the Swedish divers from the group Ocean X explored the bottom of the Baltic Sea. With a name such as Ocean X, something straight from a science fiction B-movie, they had to be sure they'd find something strange. They certainly did. A strange disk was found at the floor of the ocean. It was 60 meters in width and resembled that the Millennium Falcon had plopped down in the Baltic. It was evident that UFO hunters went crazy. Theories were circulating on the internet. UFO people believe this was irrefutable evidence of aliens landing on Earth. The object looked too fake to believe it was made naturally. It even appeared as if it had stairs that were off towards the side. The more grounded theorists thought it was the turret of an old-fashioned battleship, or perhaps a Nazi anti-submarine mine. However, that wasn't compatible with the dates as it was likely to be 20,000 years old. In the end, scientists came to the rescue and proved that it's likely an ice-deposited deposit. However, it's an extremely bizarre glacial deposit. UFO theorists aren't convinced and believe there's some kind of government cover-up. Even scientists are still fighting over the exact cause. This is a matter of debate at this moment. With the exception of that whole Falcon issue, it's just ridiculous. While covering the list of mysterious things at the bottom of the ocean, we have came up with another. At number two of our list is Bimini Road. Roads and bridges shouldn't be submerged. The ancient roads belong underwater, much less. However, off the Bahama Islands, there's an ancient road that seems to have been constructed many years ago. It's what some believe. Then called Bimini Road, this is the thought of route that leads to Atlantis. The first time it was discovered was in the 1960s. Bimini Road is a collection of stones laid in a row, similar to an underwater cobblestone roadway. The artifact abruptly starts and then ends, suggesting that it's just a tiny portion of a long-forgotten causeway. The main question was how it came to end up submerged in the first place? There was no major civilization focused on the Bahamas as conspiracy theorists claimed they were part of the earlier Atlantean Highway. Then, to make matters even more interesting, the Bimini Road was the result of an earlier prediction made by the American legendary Edgar Case. A portion of the temples may yet be discovered under the slime of ages and seawater near Bimini, expected in 68 or 69, not so far away. Bimini Road was found in 1968. Like most of the time, scientists come up with a different, and likely more rational explanation for this. It was a very bizarre-looking nature-inspired rock form. Analyzing the rocks found the absence of evidence that they had been damaged by tools. However, it's an interesting phenomenon, and Edgar Cayce's astonishingly accurate prophecy hides the underwater causeway in mystery. Well, thanks for being with us on the journey to explore the strangest things underwater. The next thing we came up with, at number three of our list is the Jost fleet of TR Gike Lagoon. In 1944, World War II was going very, very badly to the Japanese. Allied forces had gained superior air power as well. United States bombers could fly across the Pacific and bomb Japanese vessels without worry about retribution. In this situation, the Japanese made the bizarre choice to hold the bulk of their navy in one location that is Truck Lagoon. Truck Lagoon in the Caroline Islands. The Allies unleashed a massive two-day airstrike against the lagoon. The Japanese lost 50 ships and 250 planes which represented a large part of their remaining fleet. There was a war to be fought and the Americans were not able to cleanse the island. All of the war debris that was buried was buried at the bottom of the ocean. Divers began re-exploring the lagoon during the 1960s and revealed the haunting underwater graveyard through documentary films. The planes, ships, as well as tanks remain in perfect state. Incredibly, many contained the remains of Japanese sailors in there. Tourists can now plunge into the burial ground. The bodies have been mercifully removed. However, it's not a safe place. Metal edges that have been blasted ships could easily cut skin, 
and this would be an inconvenience of a minor nature in the event that the water wasn't shark infested. However, as we all do you know they are. The old-fashioned tech has been leaking harmful fuel and oil into the ocean for over more than 70 years. Evidently, Ghost Fleet is trying to defend itself. After this, we are moving towards another amazing and strange things which is, at number 4 of our list we have underwater rivers. Rivers aren't supposed to be found underwater, unless you're SpongeBob. It turns out, however, that rivers can be formed underwater if there is the right mix of conditions in the water. Maybe it's just there as a magic. It's unclear. The most extensive and best underwater river is located in the Yucatan Peninsula. In its bottom ocean, there is an extremely tiny layer of hydrogen sulfur that creates an insulator that separates two water layers. It's not something that a diver is able to feel when traversing across, yet it does create an additional layer of water beneath the actual ocean. It's not just a bizarre shape that divers refer to as an underwater river, even although it doesn't look like one. Leaves that have fallen over the banks have dirt the river. Submerged trees line the banks. In addition to being submerged, it appears like the typical terrestrial river. The river could be the coolest thing we've ever seen, or perhaps one of the most disturbing. There's nothing like it anywhere in the world. It appears as if a chunk of dry land was submerged due to a super-aggressive mythological god, without making any changes. The reason why the system has survived is beyond our comprehension. If we had doctoral degrees in oceanography, perhaps we could begin to comprehend the system. However, what we can't understand is why someone hasn't created a truly cool underwater horror film about it. Call James Cameron on the phone. So far we have covered some amazing things we found at the bottom of the ocean. Let's now move towards the next strange thing, which is at number 5 of our list called UpSweep. Many governments around the world operate ocean listening networks from all over the world. They claim they're studying the oceans in order to understand glaciers' eruptions, volcanic activity, and migration of animals. From what we've seen, they are mostly used by governments to record spooky sounds from the depths that resemble Cthulhu. The most well-known is Bloop, which everybody believed was a huge ocean monster calling mating, however, it turned out to be an ordinary floating ice shelf breaking. As the girl who was the most popular at high school bloop was a hit with everyone's eyes however, it left the truly obscure sounds unnoticed. The most unique of them all is the upsweep sound, a regular rising sound that's been being heard since the year 1991. Contrary to other odd noises, upsweep is regular and consistent with no randomness as one would expect from natural phenomena, and it keeps popping up without reason. In 1991 onward, upsweep was gradually getting less raucous but it's visible to underwater hydrophones. The officially owned National Oceanic and Atmosphere Administration website states that they don't know to explain why this happens. Even the government publicly admits to being stumped. Then we can be sure that upsweep is the result of something incredible. As long as we don't know for certain sea monsters are within the possible realm. Hey folks, congratulations we have covered five mysterious things so far under the deep bottom of the ocean. If you liked it, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel to know more about unknown, bizarre, and strangest information.